Hey, what is going on guys? It's Elkon here, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to beat the Great Ape the fastest and bestest way possible. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Before I get right into fighting the Great Ape and showing you guys how to consistently hit your move slash abilities, I'm going to quickly have you guys turn on a setting in your Roblox settings that's going to help you improve your aim and basically make you incapable of missing. The first thing you're going to want to do is press the exit key on your keyboard and it's going to bring up a menu looking like this. Now that this menu is up, you're going to head over here to the settings panel and once you've clicked it, you're going to see a ton of Roblox settings. From here, you're just going to come up here to the top and you're going to see an option called shift lock switch. It's going to be off for you automatically. You just want to turn it on and you are good to go. Once you have turned it on, you're just going to click the exit key again and it's going to take away your menu. Now what you're going to do is click the shift key on your keyboard and it's going to lock your character in first person point of view, but your camera is still going to be in third person unless you zoom in. So once you click the shift key, it's going to do this. And as you can see, you can aim better and your character is going to move where your cursor moves. You can zoom in, but as you can see, when I zoom in, you're going to see that blue glare that could be a little blinding and hard to see the great ape or just any enemy in general. Not everyone is going to have that little blue glare. It all depends on what evolution you are. Since I'm evolution Kai, I'm going to have that blue glare that's going to be a little hard to see enemies with. Now you're probably thinking, Elcon, the only reason you have that little blue glare is because of the transformation you're in. That's actually not the case. If I come over here to my transformation list and I click none, as you can see, I still have the same blue glare when I zoom in. Like I said before, it all depends on what evolution you have, but it really doesn't matter about the blue glow because you still can see the great ape with no problem at all. Now that we got the shift lock switch covered, let's get right into fighting the great ape so I can show you how the shift lock switch works. Now that we're in here and about to fight the great ape, what you're going to do is click that shift key once again and zoom in. Now that you see that blue glow, you still can see the great ape now you're just going to use your attacks and it's going to help you not miss whatsoever as you can see i have a clear shot every time to hit him with the shift lock switch now that we got done covering the shift lock switch let's get right into what moves you should be using to beat the great ape a lot faster in my opinion, the best possible moveset to use against the Great Ape would be the moveset that I'm currently using. The moves that I'm using are Special Cannon, Energy Barrage, Zalic Gun, and Ape Beam. The reason of why this moveset is the best against the Great Ape would be because of how much damage each of these moves do and what the cooldowns are. So I'm going to quickly explain each move, how much damage it does, and what the cooldowns are. The first move we're going to talk about is Special Cannon. Special Cannon has a 4 second cooldown and can do 7 to 105 damage. The second move that we're going to talk about is Energy Barrage. Energy Barrage doesn't even have a cooldown and it does 15 to 22.5 damage per hit. The third move that we're going to talk about is Zalic Gun. Zalic Gun has an 8 second cooldown and can do up to 55 to 60 damage. The fourth and final move that we're going to talk about is 8 Beam. 8 Beam has a 5 second cooldown and can do up to 75 to 85 damage. Now that I've covered each of the moves, you can clearly see on why this is the best moveset to use against the Grade 8. If you don't believe that, then you're more than welcome to swap around the moves and try it out yourself, but I promise you I've tried every single move, I've looked at every cooldown and seeing how much damage they could possibly do and this is the best moveset that I could come up with. Now clearly this moveset could be better if you have the extra move game pass but there's really not a point for it because these four moves itself can beat the great ape in no time. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you found it helpful. If you guys have any questions on Super Evolution or this video in general then let me know in the comment section down below and I'll help you with any problem or question that you have. Without further ado, this is the end of the video, so make sure to drop a massive like to show me that you enjoyed it, click that big red subscribe button to support the channel, and click that notification bell to never miss an upload. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out, everybody.